Good evening, campers, and welcome aboard the Eden's Gate Fleet Carrier. I am Commander Exorcist, and we are currently about 200 light years shy of the North American Nebula on our way to continue cataloging and researching biology. So, um, normally on Tuesday, I would do a Taco Tuesday, but you know what didn't happen this week? We didn't get a Galnet article. That's right, we are stuck without knowing what's happening in the greater elite dangerous galaxy, primarily from a lore perspective. So I am breaking the fourth wall completely today to bring you a brief message, something that I actually had planned to do later on in the uh, month. But hey, I figure this is probably the best time to do it since uh, we've got kind of a free night to talk about elite dangerous. So um, I recently released the trailer for season six of Out There. I cannot believe that I've been doing that for six years. Um, I remember a long time ago when I did the first trailer and as kind of a way to get myself to actually start putting those together and, and did the first season, which was a lot of fun. And so um, I had talked to a few folks and some folks have heard me talk about how Out There season six is going to be a little bit different. And it is, and so I wanted to kind of talk a little bit about what's going to be different. I won't be very long with it. It'll be brief because it's not very dramatic. But uh, for the last, I'd say, probably three or four years, um, maybe maybe longer, Out There has been a weekly event. So I've published an episode of Out There every Saturday at noon, give or take. I miss a few here and there for sickness or real-world complications. Um, that is not going to happen this year. So... Um, I am stepping back on uh, the release cycle for Out There. Um, but, and that's not to say Out There is going away. It's, so what I'm doing is I've decided to sacrifice quantity for quality. And so um, beginning on the 27th of January, which is the official published release date for Episode 1 of Season 6, um, Out There is going to be published on the second and fourth Saturday of each month. And so... Um, and what it's going to be is on the second and fourth Saturday, there will be an episode of Out There that's about a minute and a half longer than what you're, what you're used to. So clock in at about four, four and a half minutes roughly. So what you'll get is twice a month, um, almost four, four and a half minutes of, um, you know, beautiful and breathtaking, wondrous locations in Elite. And the reason for that is because over the last couple of years, what out there has turned into is kind of visiting three planets per episode. And I don't know where that come from. I really don't. I just kind of started. It's like an OCD thing. Three planets, publish the locations, visit, film, about a minute apiece on each location, and then move on. And what has happened is I'm missing out on a lot of other stuff. There's other things in Elite to explore than just planet surfaces. So I want to get back to taking um, video of stuff like neutron stars and black holes and some of the crazy stars that are out there, some of the beautiful gas giants that we don't get to walk on. Um, so, you know, I want to start getting back to some of that stuff. So that's, that's primarily the reason. And also having about a two-week gap between releasing each episode gives me a chance to kind of slow down and find some more interesting locations because after a while it's like well you know I need another planet you know I've got two planets I need a third one so I can finish the episode of out there and eventually you'll just take I'll just take anything I can get just to fill in the uh, the gaps and um, I'm not happy with that that's not my uh, that's not my style um, that's not the quality of content that I want to put out and so um, I'm happy with out there in the last two years. I'm very happy with it, but it's not sustainable um, in terms of being able to constantly be out there trying to find these locations and publish weekly. So um, it'll be every two weeks, starting on the 27th. Um, there'll be a little bit longer episodes. So um, you'll get more, more meat. Uh, you just have to wait a little bit longer for it. And I think that'll be fine. I think that'll be a nice compromise. Um, still be doing Taco Tuesdays on Tuesdays, or at least... This is a perfect example. Elite Dangerous owns Tuesday nights. So uh, um, unless I'm severely sick or something else is going on, I will publish something related to Elite on Tuesday nights. If we get a Galnet article, we'll do a Taco Tuesday. If we don't, maybe I'll just sit here and rant. Um, I'm really liking showing off the Eden's Gate. The Eden's Gate spent about a year and a half out in um, 
Dry a Blue. I did a uh, out there episode about it shortly after it arrived. And now it has come home to the bubble and is doing some scientific research. Like I said, we're on our way to the North American Nebula. So um, if you see us out there, give us an 07 because the Eden's Gate is out there doing the Lord's work. Um, I think that's about it, really. It's, it's kind of a five-minute ramble video. I'm not really sure it needed a video, but I really just kind of wanted to put a face to the reasoning um, because I haven't really made that public. But yes, out there is going to be cut down significantly this year. And it's not because I'm getting tired of it or I'm getting, I'm like cutting it out or anything. It's, it's a compromise for me. It's a compromise where I can, um, you know, cut back on the number of episodes that I'm publishing and greatly increase the quality of what I'm publishing. And so that's, that's more my style. And so I'm really, um, that's all that's going on. So, um, yeah, that's about it. So thanks everybody for watching. Um, I won't continue to ramble. I got nothing else to say. No Galnet. I guess that, I mean, Zemina Torval is like the last article they left. And I'm assuming they're going to let that article get as old as she is before they publish a new one. So go figure. Everybody, I'm Commander Exorcist. Take care. Fly safe. And I will see you out there. Good night.